Good morning, Glacier. It is Friday, September 30th, 2022. I'm Jacob. And I'm Kaya. Today is the final day of Spirit Week. Great job, GHS. Enjoy Wolfpack Navy and Green Spirit Day. We're starting off this episode with a spotlight on Echoes. International Super Spy. Super Spy! Hi, I'm Gabby, and I'm here with... Kaylin Holt. And Kaylin Holt, what grade are you? I am a senior. Alrighty, and then we know you're in choir, mm -hmm. and you're also in Echoes, right? Yes. And is this your first year in Echoes? Yes. Slay. So what are you most excited for this year in Echoes? Um, I'm probably most excited for the group, just because we have a lot of new people. I think we only have like two returners from Echoes last year, so I'm really excited to see how we all do together. So what does choir mean to you? I like to sing. <laughs> um, and yeah, I love singing, so okay. that's why I'm there. Oh, thank you, Caitlin. Yeah. Hi, my name is Jacob, and I'm here with Bridger. Uh, what are you most excited for this year? I'm most excited for. I'm excited that Cade Bowles is in Echoes this year. Nice. Um, is this your first year in Echoes? No, I was in Echoes last year. All right, and what's different about Echoes this year compared to last year so far? Well, Cade Bowles is in Echoes this year, and we also have a lot more tenors, which is really, really good. All right, thank you, Bridger. Hi, I'm Gabby, and I'm here with... Mr. Connell. And Mr. Connell is our choir director, as well as the director of Echoes, which is what we're going to be talking about today. So first of all, can you tell us what Echoes is? Yes, Echoes is um, our top choir for juniors and seniors. It's our small group. We have concert choir, which has like 60, and that's mostly juniors and seniors. And then Echoes kids come from concert choir, and they sing um, chamber music, smaller group music. And so that's about 15 singers this year, and they're in two class periods of choir. And so because it's a smaller class and you spend Echoes together as well as a different period, is it, has there been any moments where you've been like, these kids are awesome or any moments that are just kind of funny? Sure, yeah. Um, we're doing some some more challenging music to kind of start the year, and there's a specific section of a piece called Sing Me to Heaven uh, that they picked up. I was like, this is the hardest section of the piece, and they got it way faster than I was kind of anticipating, and I pushed them, my juniors and seniors, they learn the music by themselves. I don't tell them the notes, and so they got it really fast, and I was really impressed. So. Perfect, thank you. Yep. And now for a segment we call Food Fight Friday. Fiona, can we get a check of what you're reading or eating? Abby slices. What else? Can um, I get a tour? Um, I have last night's leftovers. It's tikka masala. My mom made it. And goldfish, the normal kind. The normal kind, not extra cheesy. No. Um, and I'm also drinking aha caffeinated sparkling water. Um, uh, it's Fuji apple white tea. Hi, I'm Gabby and I'm here with Eric. And Eric, what did you eat for lunch today? I don't eat. I photosynthesize. Okay. I'm Gabby and I'm here with well, uh, Miss Gray. And what are you eating for lunch today, Miss Gray? I have beef stroganoff and a bagel. I see that you have the bagel in your hand. Can you give us like a visual of the bagel? <laughs> Very nice. And here's what you need to know. Are you interested in joining Wolfpack Speech and Debate this season? We will have a meeting to kick off the season on Monday, October 3rd at 3.33 p.m. in the E100 porch. We will excuse those who need to go to other practices before 4 p.m., but the meeting is scheduled to last until 5 p.m. See a coach if you are interested but cannot attend. Coaches this year in the building are Mr. Adkins, Ms. Brown, Ms. Menson, Ms. Moore, Mr. Monroe, Ms. Fritz, and Mr. Adamchek. You, congratulations, you've reached your senior year. It's time to start thinking about graduation. Follow the link on the Daily Bulletin to be directed to the Jawson slash GHS website or go to the Jawson site and search for Glacier High School to order your cap and gown. Uh, Jawson's representative will be available on October 5th at lunch to answer any question. Attention all students, it's DECA time. DECA will hold, hold its first meeting of the year on Tuesday, October 4th from 5.30 to 7 p.m. in the room 
A106. Schedules, event planning, and fees will be discussed. DECA is open to all students. Come find out what the heck is DECA and start working your way to Disney World. See Mr. Monroe for more information. Man Mortgage encourages all seniors to enter to win a $500 scholarship. One lucky winner will be selected and announced at halftime during the Crosstown football game on October 14th. Stop by the Career Center before October 13th to sign up. Students, the yearbook is in need of photos from you. Looking for students who have face injuries, B reels, 0.5 pictures, senior baby pics, as well as photos of your summer activities and trips, your homecoming proposals, your homecoming dinners, and the dance to GHS yearbook at sc5.k12.mt.us. If you can't figure out the email, you can also use the HGE Share app or hgashare.com using the code Glacier to submit photos for all of these sections. Best of luck to the Wolfpack teams this weekend. Of course, our golf team is there in their final day at state tournament in Helena. Our Wolfpack football hosts Helena tonight at 7 p.m. at Legends, and our soccer teams host Missoula Hellgate on Saturday. Remember, all detailed announcements can be found on the Daily Bulletin link on the school website, and this episode and every GTV episode can be found on the same site and on our YouTube channel. Thanks for watching. Remember to respect, respect yourself, respect, respect others, and, and respect, respect the building. building. Expect excellence. Please stand for the Pledge of Allegiance. I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the republic for which it stands, one nation, under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all.